Hello guys, welcome back on our Ikla YouTube channel. My name is Gustavo, but you can call me Gus. Uh, today we are on our fourth day of the bootcamp and maybe do you want something to drink and then we can get started. We took a lot of uh, CSGO tactics, but some of them we need to rework for sure because like smoke's working different and also you have that uh, effect when you nailing the smoke inside. Uh, we are working all together. We sharing opinions and finding con conclusions with each other. Uh, overall, like I like this game. I like how it looks, but uh, still need to do like a lot of rework things or just just make it better. I would like to do 10 because now it's uh, much easier to do some pops or contact plays through the smoke by using the net and also with this net you can take like a lot of information see if you're gonna use it in a proper way. Uh, we already grown up but still we need like to set up some extra rules, build a big 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 platform so everyone gonna be on the same page and we're gonna work like the whole team. Uh, I would say TSM. We're getting a lot of fun inside the chat during the game. Actually, uh, I don't think so. Like, uh, <laughs> I'm looking forward to play next show match and beat him finally because we lost, lost last time. So, yeah, same. <laughs> <laughs> Daily routine for me is. Uh, Cold shower and uh, gym if I have time or uh, jog to run. No? Actually, I don't have any routine in the morning. Like uh, I'm waking up, uh, brushing my teeth, taking shower, and then I'm ready for the day. Yeah, normal stuff. Yeah, nothing special. I think uh, now we are working at it because we are on the bootcamp. First time we met each other before we didn't see each other. Maybe, maybe we met on some tournament. Yeah, for sure. But I think we never really talked. Yeah, in the scene, you kind of know each other. So yeah. yeah. So now uh, we are trying to build the team, like spending time together, going out for the dinner, and uh, we hope for some winning matches on the bottom. I think uh, we have a really good uh, like team environment and a uh, good facility here to uh, practice and uh, get to know each other. So I think we have uh, everything that we need to to be the best. We just have to work hard and uh, improve ourselves. I agree, nothing to add. Look, okay, she sent a pics of me before they... We all got to the new place, to the Lisbon, with our new international roster. And we are ready to train to smash every single CS2 players. And help me to show you our bootcamp. See you guys. Okay guys, so today we are going to show you the facility, the rooms inside, where we are practicing, where we are chilling, and yeah, uh, let's get started. Let's start with the first one. What do you say about that one? Uh, like it looks like... No, not, it doesn't look, but it's like... Place where you can play poker, but usually here we are chilling after practice, you know, having fun. Yeah, that's it. Do you like the room? Uh, the other room. The other room usually, like as you can see, there is a uh, PlayStation. Uh, sometimes after practice, like... After practice, like sometimes you're chilling here as well, like playing video games on PS hmm. and yeah. Also we have team talk here sometimes and yeah. When are you sitting in here? What are you talking about? I mean overall like how the day went and yeah. Um, what what we did wrong, what we what we can correct and yeah. Like quick recap of the day, you know. How much time you spent here? Uh not sure actually like uh, Depends. Uh, one hour sometimes, two hours. As well, as you can see, we are chilling sometimes, playing games here as well, so... Well, that's great. And maybe we can go to the balcony? Yeah, sure. Most of my teammates are spending time, like, when we have pause, like, during the practices. They are, like, smoking, chilling, you know? And the kitchen. What are I supposed to be? <laughs> Women. <laughs> The kitchen about kitchen don't ask me anything. I don't know literally anything about kitchen. Okay. Uh, I can only open the fridge, take yeah. something to drink, and that's it. Like. <laughs> Show you what we have. Okay. 
I drink most of this. Cola. Juice. Uh, yeah. And we have like coffee machines, some snacks. Yep. We're just chilling. I love it. Uh, so this room is actually the most important. It's like where the where the magic happens, you know? Okay. Here is my like PC where I'm sitting. Next to me is our lovely opera, Draken. Right now he's watching some game. Our Agile is sitting here, but right now he's here. <laughs> It is our mastermind coach playing chess, you know. And our CEO chilling on the couch. Hello everyone. Thanks for watching. Give us some likes and comments. And let's not forget who legend. The legend. <laughs> yeah boy. And the other balcony doing nothing. But it's, it's pretty, pretty nice. Cool. Yeah. I like the view. Yeah, the view is much better than the other one, but like it's smaller balcony, you know? Yeah. So, what do you need to say to our mm, fans? viewers, fans? Uh, I would say like to keep supporting us and cheer for us every official. Uh, I think that the main thing we want to focus on during this bootcamp is getting into the same page and like create same vision how we want to play as a team. Because uh, we have like players from many different countries with different c culture and different approach to the game and we just need to find a uh, same vision how we want to play CS. So this is the main thing we want to focus on during this bootcamp. Guys, I will show you one trick you might not know about CS2. So if you like molly next to the smoke, you can actually stand in the molly and you will not take any damage and this is this might be the perfect example how you can do that like there is like the most basic thing you do on mirage as terrorists which is uh, doing a smokes so if you smoke behind stairs like bench smoke and you, if you molly next to it yeah like if you molly bench like that exactly uh, the city guy can actually pick you behind the smoke and he will not take any damage because smoke is kind of covering him and I'm not burning in the molly because uh, smoke is uh, fading, fading the flames or I don't know how it works I don't, I'm not sure if it's a bug or what but not many players know about it and I think it's pretty useful tip and good to know about it and the other most common trick is to learn how to use the nades in the smokes and this is very powerful if you connect that with the flash from your teammates for, for example uh, you can nade the smoke and pick it and it's really hard to counter such plays for the enemies hello guys today i will show my video settings uh, in csgo Tak. Ryan? In CS2 maybe? Maybe ah, in CS2. No. <laughs> no. No. Hello guys, today I will show you my NVIDIA settings and CS2 settings. We start from adjust uh, settings. Here it was in performance. And then manage 3D settings. It's for, for CS2. Then resolution, my gears. Here it was adjust uh, color settings and adjust the score size and yeah here is full screen gpu and that's all so here is my resolution this is uh, settings boost player contrast disable vertical desync uh, disable anti-aliasing mode 4x global shadow quality high texture detailist high filtering mode 4x uh, shader detailist High, Partic detail is high, this is Amblet high, dynamic range quality, uh, super resolution is disabled, high quality, and NVIDIA reflex low uh, latency disabled. Then my sense in the game, it's free on 40 dpi, and my VIF model, VIF model is the default preset post 3. Actually, yeah, there are a couple troubles and technical issues, but we are trying to solve them. 
Uh, there are a couple troubles with computers, but uh, actually we're going to fix them as soon as possible. As a bootcamp uh, overall, it's a really great place. We have office here in Lisbon. Uh, thanks to our partners and uh, we have everything needed here. I think that uh, players have everything that they would like to see on the bootcamp. We have uh, uh, nice places to eat uh, next to our office, also a lot of great places to visit here in Portugal. So yeah, overall uh, bootcamp is really great and nice, we have everything we need. Uh, actually, we are out of one of those tournaments yesterday. It was A1 league, unfortunately for us, but uh, yeah, as you said in this question, there are some priorities for us, uh, of course, um, there are very important tournaments like uh, ECA Challenger League, so yeah, we are focusing on uh, that one, we have to play with stand-ins because of the rules of the tournament, because we qualified for this tournament with the pre uh, previous squad, uh, that's why we need to use uh, guys from uh, ECLA UA, big thanks for them because uh, they have uh, to spend time with us and uh, cannot practice with their team on these uh, match days, but yeah. Anyway, after we will go out from the group tournament group, we will, we will be able to play with uh, all our players from main roster and I think that we can then show our potential in the playoffs. So, yeah, every tournament is uh, pretty important for us, so we want uh, to put uh, all uh, our forces and strengths to win uh, every tournament because we need to grow in ratings and we want uh, to get rating before the RMR and the major qualifying will start, so we can be ahead of some team. Something like this. Uh, yeah, sure. Our psycho psychologist uh, made uh, some uh, great practices for us uh, for this bootcamp, prepared it for us. So we, uh, with Wolf together, will make some psychologist trainings for all the team uh, where we will be making this team building happening. And also uh, here in Lisbon, there are a lot of great places like beaches, like parks, uh, etc. We will play laser tags, paintball, maybe we'll do some karting if the weather will be fine. So yeah, we, will, we are trying to make a lot of stuff together. So to get uh, this uh, team synergy on the highest level, we want uh, players to feel comfortable with each other. And I guess this uh, bootcamp will help, help them very well. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. <laughs> <Gays>. <laughs> Okay guys, thank you for watching this video, please cheer for Ikla, uh, the players need your support, so cheer for us, tap your like, leave comment below, and thanks for watching. Thank you for watching Ikla, play wild!